Police arrested a suspect for murdering a 79-year-old woman during a home invasion. Surveillance video recorded the intruder knocking on the door of her Bedford home, asking to use the phone. Fox 4's Dan Anglin joins us now with the latest. Dion. Hi there, Heather. A family is grieving the loss of a mother and grandmother. The police call her death senseless, and they have arrested and charged a man with murder who approached her home. Rang the doorbell. The victim made contact with the individual at the door. Um, that person asked to use her phone. Uh, when she refused, um, we uh, believe that the subject forces way in. Bedford police described the encounter last Thursday that has resulted in this man, 39 year old Brandon Paramore, charged with murder. Investigators say Paramore approached retired homeowner, 79 year old Christine Barsanti, at her front door. And when she wouldn't let him in, he overpowered her. The door was open so they could communicate, and he forced his way in after that. Barsanti's grandchildren discovered her body. A family that seems to talk to each other quite a bit came over to check on her well being and discovered the house unsecured. The officers that were called to the scene reviewed that ring video doorbell and were listening to the voice of the person and recognized it as being an individual they had dealt with earlier in the day. Police say Paramore has a distinctive southern accent and hours before he approached Barsanti's home, he was loitering and panhandling at several businesses which called to report him. After the discovery of Barsanti's body and the ring camera video, Officers located Paramore and placed him under surveillance. We maintained a visual on the individual um, from the time that we believed him to be a person of interest. We located where he was and watched him and just kind of were keeping eyes on his movements. And um, at a certain time, they approached him just on the street and began talking to him and were able to place him into custody for the unrelated charges. The medical examiner has not released Barsanti's cause of death. Police say the family told them it appeared she'd been hit with an unknown object. A motive is still under investigation. Right now, after we establish and continue to figure out what exactly occurred in the house. And now, police say Paramore had an outstanding warrant out of the city of Euless for drug paraphernalia. They arrested him on that charge, and then later the murder charge was added. He is now, a check after a check of online records, he's being transferred from the Bedford City Jail to the Tarrant County lockup.